So tell me about the vote today, Senator. Was it a hard one to cast? It's a very difficult vote um, because there are two issues at play. One is the creditworthiness of the United States, which for the first time in my career here has seriously was placed in jeopardy by Republicans who were claiming that they would not vote for any extension or any circumstances, and simultaneously saying it would have no effect when it could be really, it would have been devastating, and it was devastating to families uh, throughout Rhode Island. But the other part of this was the a procedure, a process of trying to reach tests of reduction, which began with uh, cuts without also balancing revenue increases, then led to a possibility that uh, beginning in January of 2013, there would be automatic reductions in spending. And the problem here is just to inject so much uncertainty into the economy, and it doesn't also accomplish the, the second objective. Not only do we have to reduce deficit, we also have to grow the economy. In fact, they're related. So uh, that balance, that, that difficult choice, ultimately uh, I, and very difficultly, I resolved that we had to signal very strongly that we would not let the United States default on an obligation. It would have been a catastrophic event that would have haunted us for decades, generations. So that was the, the, the tipping point, but it was a very close call.